All right, check it out, everyone. We're back playing Fallout New Vegas, doing a no gun run, just punching our exploding our way through this. And look, we got we're in a perfect position now to punch and explode. We got Veronica with us. We both have these power fists on, and we're hanging out up here with the boomers up in Nellis. And they love to blow stuff up. So uh, we've kind of found our people here, you know what I mean? Uh, so, yeah, we're... Uh, we're just trying to help them out here, and they got a bug problem, uh, or something, some critters, maybe they're not bugs, I don't even remember, they're, they're rats or bugs or something, and, uh, they're infested here, and we gotta take care of it for them, so, uh, we are doing, like, a kind of a dumb run, we have no intelligence, no charisma, and no barter either, so uh, some of the negotiations, <laughs> you know, a little difficult. Uh, apparently, there was some uh, device we could have got to help out here, but uh, we're not like sciencey enough to understand how to use it. So we're here at the generators. We got the key. All right, you guys ready? Now the only problem here is that they said that these uh, what are they? Oh, they're giant ants, right? They said that these ants. Oh, I guess not. They said they're gonna blow up or something. Uh, they're filled with uh, gas or something. I don't know. Oh, this poor guy. Yeah, they said they sent a bunch of people in here. Oh my God! Look at what we got, guys. Okay, I say no guns, but a grenade. It's a rifle, but I mean, come on. It's like a splo. These guys are using it. They're the boomers. They like to see things go boom. You know, it's just like. It's just like a missile launcher, but smaller, you know, so uh, that qualifies, right? So we're going to be using that. <laughs> we got a new toy, guys. Um, but mostly also we're going to try to punch. And uh, we just don't want them to blow up if we punch. But that, that uh, you know, Veronica and, oh my God, Rex, who I was just about to say your freaking name. Uh, God knows where Rex ran off to, but we're getting the uh, kill cams from another room, which always freaking scares me in this freaking game, guys. That always gives me a jump scare. All right. Rex, I don't know where you were, but uh, good, good dog, good dog, good dog. All right. There's nobody here. Where the heck are these freaking bugs? All right. This is going to be fun. Uh, just smashing some stuff and blowing. Then maybe we'll get some blown up in our face, and that'll be pretty funny, too. All right. Yeah, I'm spamming vats because like, I don't know where these things are. They don't, it doesn't seem all that infested here. How did these people, what are these people dying to? Oh, we got some rounds. All right, now, rounds, of course, you know, we're not going to use these rounds unless we find more damn grenades. But, uh, this is how we make a lot of caps. So, uh, oh, there we go, missiles. So, yeah, oh, man, I wasn't even thinking that. We're doing, we must have been doing dynamite, maybe a frag grenade here or there. But I've almost completely forgot about missile launchers, honestly. So, uh, we're going to be doing that as we get into later in the game. For sure, that'll be fun. There we go, more of those grenades. I don't know if that's the same. I know there's 25 and 40. I think we actually have the 40. Uh, but I, either way, you know, it's good stuff. All right, well, I hope the boomers don't mind us. You know, we're just using this for, uh, well, we actually aren't using it for <laughs> killing the things. But, uh, you know, you got to finance the operation somehow, right? We're going to be using a lot of energy to de deal with this. We might have to repair our armor power fist, so we need the caps, right? All right, we got to fix the generators or something. There we go. All right, well, that did something. All right, so now this will bring out the bugs, I guess. All right, so th is that it? We're done? I mean, this was no mission. Was This, the this is the mission. Come on, I want to get into a fight. We've seen two freaking bugs so far. Thump thump. And more grenades. Okay, and guess what? We got over a cucumber there. What the frick is a thump thump? What am I looking at? All right, well, we can repair our metal armor now and get, make me get some carry weight here. There we go. All right, we're good for now. We don't got to uh, slide stuff over to Veronica just yet. All right, bug, uh, come out, come out wherever you are. They're on the map. I mean, they're on, there's markers on the uh, pip thing. All 
I'm like, are they, I didn't nooks and crannies here. No, well, I'm also looking for whatever else we got to turn on. I think, oh, I remember right. It's right up here. I don't know. All right, well, we can go over here. Can we make it? Yeah, we got it. All right, we're good. All right, there's got to be a bug in here, right? There's, oh, I, no wonder it was so freaking dark. Oh, scrap metal. We got, we got a side quest to give scrap metal to the guy over there, the kid. And that's good. That'd be real cool if we could uh, finish that quest in here. If there's a lot of scrap. All right, Veronica. Man, I love this run with Veronica. Well, I don't, I'm not even going to get any other uh, companions. I might even dump Rex back off at the king, to be honest with you. But I like having him here for now. But a little extraneous. But, uh, you know, we just fixed his brain a couple eps ago. So... You know, here we are. This that must be the one Rex killed earlier. And uh, since uh, Rex isn't running off, I don't know where the heck the rest of these even are. We're back at the entrance. What the frick? That ain't it. <laughs> I know I need to turn something on here. I, I didn't really read the instructions all that good, but. I mean, I've definitely done this quest before, but that was a long time ago, too. All right, so this is a different boomer that I think we missed before, but I think we came in right here. All right, we got to look at the map, local. All right, well, there's the... Oh, we got to go into that tunnel. Okay. They're in the tunnel. Oh, and there was a back... Okay, okay. I think they expected us maybe to go in the back door there, and then we would have immediately faced the, you know, the, the threat. But we went in the front door and uh, whatever. So, and then that panel is on the stair stairwell. Now I remember. All right. Can I go this way? It's under. It's under us. Yeah, it's right under us. I, it was that big like garage door thingy. But I still want to see if there's anything good in here that I missed. No. All right. Uh, we can make the jump again. You guys might have to go around. Oh, or we can jump down on that. Can I jump on that? Nah, eh, let's just take the stairs. Oh, Rex. Bro. All right, we're good. All right, right there is the... Uh... All right. Yeah. Is it this... Oh, there, the manhole. No, we don't got to go in the manhole. I thought the thing was on the manhole. Uh, it's that yellow dot. All right. I just walked right past it. Veronica, what are you doing? Still? Okay. All right. So we're done. Uh, except we still got to kill the rest of the ants. Now, maybe this is what's going to get more ants out here. Okay. Restart the two array. I, it's so specific here. I didn't even know the instructions, but uh, we did it. All right. Are there more? There is one more over there, I think. Well, we can go now into the uh, garage and just, uh, I'm, I'm like bored now. We got to fight some stuff. A plunger. Eh. I think you can craft something with that, but I might do some crafting. Rex, <laughs> the vats, the vats is, I'm losing control of the vats. All right, there we go. All right, so I think we can just punch and they don't, they don't explode. Okay. He said something about exploding. Uh, they explode. That would be crazy, though. Well, I know we can get a power fist that actually makes everything explode. It makes it real difficult to uh, stay alive. We got to hit them far out of the way. All right, we're not eating any ant meat or nectar. <laughs> That's for sure. All right, doggy. Okay, this has got to be the mother load in this room. We're done. That was it. There was two freaking ants. What the frick? Ants. Loyal may have something to help. We Well, that's why I was saying we don't have the uh, science skill to get that. Ants in the generator. All right, so I guess maybe... Uh, okay, I guess maybe when we turned everything on and it came out of the woodwork and we, we just got to go back through it. Or maybe when we kill this one, it spawns. Yeah, there we go. See, they weren't even there. They weren't even there. All right, but whatever. This mission's too easy. Give me some challenge here. 
But we are playing on hard mode. I mean, this isn't like a, a walk in a park. But, uh... I don't think ants are going to be that much trouble. We do have this, the fist leveled up to 80. Uh, which is pretty good this early in the game. Even though we're here, we're still early in the game. I haven't even been to Vegas yet or anything. Alright. They're not even paying attention. And we just one-shot all of them. God, that kill cam when you don't actually kill something. Maybe we didn't one-shot it. We just stunned it. Because then they, they get the kill cam. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Oh, there we go. Where the heck was that? Now my light turned off, too. Oh, my God. Are you okay? Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, we'll let them take care of that one. Oh! That's how you do it. All right, Rex. Rex is ready to go. Yeah, go for it. I want to let them kill some, but I also want to get... Get some action myself. All right, see, that's the explosion. That doesn't seem like much. All right, one more over here. Where are these coming from? They just spawn. What? Oh, it must be up there. See, in the rubble would be cool. That's a weird f mission. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's Rex. I guess we got to go back up. They just show up. All right. Come on, boomers. I guess we go that way or we go around. It could lead all leads to the same spot. Oh, there we go. Veronica. I'm Tr not trying. Yeah, trouble. Oh, pop. Oh, see, we didn't do much damage on that at all the first hit. Let's do this. Oh, there we go. Oh, we got, all right. We got the thumbnail. We got the thumbnail, guys. There's the explosion. All right, that's not going to do any damage to us. All right, that's the dead boomer we found. Oh, there's a salt carbine that I didn't notice. All right, well, that'll get us some caps. Those are, those are uh, pretty valuable, I think. Oh, Rex, go for it. I got some vats in there, too. Oh, there we go. Maybe that's the thumb. I don't know. They're both, it's all lit so poorly, though. There's more. You know there's more when you got Rex growling like that. Uh, we, there's only two dead boomers. There's two over here. Oh, there's more downstairs. The, the, how did they get downstairs? We we're just there. This is so weird. Yeah, we, were we just there? That looks like a giant anthill. Are they coming out of there? Can I throw? Yeah, let's throw some grenades down there. I don't want to go back down there. I could have used my new grenade uh, thingy. Whoa, that was weird. <laughs> they do the uh, kill cam in slow motion, but also makes the voice in slow motion. <laughs> so Veronica sounded like she uh, doing nitrous there. Um, anyway. All right. Let's go. Nope, that's not what I'm trying to do. Where'd the frickin' power fist go? There it is. <laughs> I forgot what my hot keys were. I haven't used them in a while. All right, so we're back here. Guys, there's got to be one more, right? Anything down? It's got to be down there because we didn't go in there yet. I mean, we did, but we didn't since we've been back. Yeah, there's one. And one by the door. Oh, no, that's just the door. Okay, that might be the last one down there. Go get it, Rex. Oh, I can't. I, I, I want to throw the grenade at it. I guess not. All right, Rex, let's go down. Boink. I love all the uh, scaffold, whatever, these stairways like this, all these industrial things in Fallout, especially in uh, Fallout 3. Some of the uh, 
dungeons, I guess you'd call them, you know, were pretty cool. These old industrial places. All right. Uh, I, well, I guess we're not throwing a freaking grenade because otherwise we'll blow Rex up. <laughs> and Rex does the job. Is that it? There's one more. There's still more. Oh, completed. Return to Raquel. All right, let's go. We can go out the back. All right, well, that was fun. It could have been... Uh, I thought they'd swarm us or something, man. I don't know. A little too easy. A little bit too easy, but, you know, what are you going to do, right? That is the one... That honestly is, like, the one thing that... Kind of my only criticism of this whole game is that sometimes it just feels, like, too civilized and peaceful. Like, it's like... 90% of the stuff we got to do here is just talking to people and doing, you know, helping. We're helping them, but uh, this is the one part of action in the whole thing, and then that was it. You know, otherwise, it's just like skill checks, uh, intelligence checks, and uh, being a talker, and hey, nothing wrong with that. I just felt like it was a little bit unbalanced uh, with the fighting and the talking. Now, that's how I felt when I first played this game when it first came out. Uh, now, I don't care. Honestly, I'd rather have the talking, personally. But, uh, you know, like as far as, especially after playing Fallout 3, which you felt like you were under constant threat of your life. And you almost never feel that way here, like that uh, something is going to just kill you out of the blue. Um, maybe uh, when you get in the wilderness a little and you, you know the legions after you and all that stuff a little bit. But... I feel like Legion is the toughest enemy in the game, or at least the most persistently, you know, brutal. They just pop out of nowhere, and then they are pretty strong. So, but then as far as the wild stuff, there's no, like, super mutants anywhere fighting you, barely. Like, there's a few, but uh, most of them are kind of civilized. Um, and there's no, like, uh, you know, there's some rad scorpions, but it's not, it's not really that bad. It's not that they're really that bad. There's not raiders, really, that, that, you know, there's the fiends. But it's not like a constant threat. Anyway. Watch your step, sister. Whoa, okay, see, she's I like see threatening us, but, you know. <laughs> the answer all dead? Yeah, we got every last one Maybe of them. Pearl is right about you. Yeah, because I don't know how you pulled that off. Well, the dog did I'll most of it. I'll tell Loyal to send someone down to clear out the eggs and repair <laughs> the We got a generators. robot dog here with a freaking brain that we transplanted from a freaking fiend's, step, uh, you know, maniac dog, so... That, that that was part of it. <laughs> look at that hockey mask. We look like a freaking thug. <laughs> I would not trust us at all, man, wearing this outfit. The hockey mask and the spikes. Anyway, let's go see if we, this guy wants some of that scrap metal. We only found one. But one's better than none. And uh, let's talk to this guy first. Oh, I can't jump on that. I jump on that, though. <laughs> hey, loyal. Oh. I thought it was the table. What is it, outsider? <laughs> All right. Goodbye. Uh, bye. This guy don't want to dog to us. All right. He don't like outsiders. But, uh, yeah. He don't care. I thought there was another uh, mission with him. Hey there. Back for more? Back for more what? Cool. How much can you spare? Well, just the Thanks. one. But, hey. Thanks for dropping it off. Anything else? Okay. So, the thing is, we like can't. Like I said. I can never get enough scrap metal. He's got a quest and all that stuff, personal I matter. You well, we are interested. It's just that we're idiots and we don't know how to ask the proper way, and then you get offended or something. I don't okay. Know. <laughs> we got, but dude, that's what I'm saying. Doing a dumb person in this game. I mean, the funny thing is, sometimes there's like unique dialogue for really dumb people. But, uh, you know, the, the triple whammy of no barter, <laughs> no intelligence, and no charisma there, and also no science, is uh, not doing us any good uh, as far as completing quests. We're going to have a lot of open quests in our quest log, but uh, I'm not too worried about that because we're having fun doing a no-gun run and uh, exploding and punching our way through the freaking wasteland here. Now let's see what else we can do. If you can't keep that thing under control, I will. Are you talking about my freaking dog Rex here? Rex, go get her. <laughs> boomer, okay, Boomer. <laughs> what the heck? You gotta insult Rex. All right. 
We did a little fast traveling, and now we're back at Crimson Caravan, and uh, I think we got to turn in a quest here or something. And maybe we can sell some stuff, too, to this guy. Not that guy, that guy. Hey there. You looking to buy or sell? Mm, maybe buy, but mostly sell. Can do. All right, what do we got? BB gun. All right, well, we don't need a BB gun. Oh, we got a salt carbine. Three, two. It's probably worth a lot more than that, but we got very low barter skill, like I said. So, you know. I don't know what I hit the wrong button there. All right, I, we got to look I, what, if this is unique or something. Oh, that's what I, yeah. I got to. Hey there. You looking to buy or sell? Now let's see. What was that? 347 or Can something? Can do. All right. Well, that didn't help that much, but we got like 20 extra caps out of that. Maybe. Flamer. That might be fun. That doesn't count. I'm not going to count that in explodes, but that might be fun. And incinerator too. Oh, God. This guy's got a lot of caps. Nice. All right. Well, we almost cleaned them out, but 1,500 caps pretty good and we got thump thump okay so thump thump is also another uh grenade rifle so we don't need a, a regular one although we could maybe repair i guess thump thump with that right like i really need three the auto spike knuckles now i gotta get rid of that too i mean come on all right let's see if we can buy anything here to uh you know so we can sell more nothing we can get some stems i guess locksmith rear might be good we can, we got, I don't have good lock pick either, but I am going to level that up. For sure. Turbo? All right. I like the brass knuckles. I, I don't use any of that. I kept every freaking hand, you know, uh, unarmed weapon here. And then... Oh, I missed. All right. That looks good. Let's just do that. And we'll go to gun runners or somewhere else and clear out whatever else we got. Pretty good. 1,500 caps. And we got like three more stems. All right. So now let's uh, re do a little repairing maybe. Spike knuckles, brass knuckles. All right. We don't need any of this. We got brass knuckles and spike knuckles. And a bladed gauntlet that's fully freaking healed. I, I, bladed gauntlet was really good for like two fights until I got the power fist. And then thump thump we can repair with the grenade rifle. All right, that's cool. All right, we are definitely going to be using that thump thump for sure. I don't think it qualifies as a gun. It, it's explosives, right? It's, it's covered by my explosive skill. I'm almost 100% positive there. Which I guess almost 100% is like less than 100%, but I'm pretty much 100%. I mean, I'm definitely 100%. What the heck are those guys doing? Are they all peeing together? I don't know. <laughs> I don't want to know. And uh, let's go talk to the lady here. Alice McClaffrey. Welcome back. Oh, well, we delivered. Oh, right. We delivered so the thing. Would you be interested in more important jobs? Um... Yeah, sure. I think we already had these quests in our log. It was a little bug. As much as I like to handle matters personally, I can't be everywhere at once. There is a negotiation with a smaller trading. There's okay. also the See, we already Henry noticed. Jameson. We already and had this conversation finally, with her. I need some. But we shouldn't have had that until after. The Jamesons so are confusing. very wealthy ranchers back in Redding, California. All right. Well, now at least uh, it's in our log. In I was that was what was weird. Posting young Henry is the manager of the New Vegas branch. Okay. As you can see, he was much more interested in Henry. All right. I, we literally already had that conversation. Thank okay. I can't do the gun runner job, but whatever. We'll it's talk about that later. Because you need to uh, sneak. We are not sneaky. We're loud and obnoxious. So we're not doing any sneaky stuff, you know? Except maybe some of that <laughs> sneaking into people's computer. Well, we can. We don't even have the intelligence. Oh, we still got the barter hat on, but that's fine. All right. Oh, look at that. New Vegas. We are not going to make it there for a while. All right. That's more like it. Here's the crew. I right, stop bargaining at everyone, Rex. Come on. 
That's why they were yelling at you before. All right. Anyway, a little fast travel here down to uh, New Vegas, and we still gotta. I think we still gotta talk to the king and show him the uh, that we fixed Rex. I don't think I've done that yet. All right. Yeah, this is what we like to do. Sh a little shadow boxing. I like that noise too. The power fest. Pretty cool stuff. All right, these are the, somebody clean up the freaking corpses, man. I could, I guess I could drag them and put them in a pile out of the way if I really cared. All right, where's the? I'm right here to see the king. Oh my god, he's not here. Hey, what's up? Where's the freaking king? You seen the king? Uh, anyone see the king? Uh, we gotta go upstairs. It's so annoying. This is the weirdest freaking layout of any building I've ever freaking been in in a video game. He's on the third floor. I know where to go now, but it's so... Yeah, even when I know, it's so confusing. So we go up to the second floor. And then you can't loop around and go to the third floor. You gotta go to another stairway down here. That this guy's on. And... Uh, why? Why is this like this? What's up? I'm up on the third floor. All right, King, you here? Hey. He ain't even here. Where the heck is this guy? You seen the King? All I do all day is read magazines. All right, you're reading the... from them. I I know all about boxing. I don't need to learn from that, but uh, good to see that you're into the same stuff we're into, I guess. Hi. King, you in here? No. Was this a school? Oh, yeah, the school of impersonation. Pacer. Oh, this guy hates us. This guy hates us. We, we, we messed up his whole thing, man. <laughs> Screw that guy. If I could kill one of these guys, I would kill him. But I like the Isn't king. The king's dog? Yeah, that's the king's dog. Hey, there you are. What are you doing just walking around, bro? Why, Rexy, you look all better, oh! boy. Oh! Did my Rexy get a new brain? Yep. <laughs> yeah, he sure did. He sure did. Should I leave you two You're alone? You're a man of your word. <laughs> no doubt about it. Can't thank you enough. If you want, hold on to Rex. All right, I guess we longer. will. I'm sure he'd enjoy that. Was there anything else you wanted? Yeah, let's ask Near him about this building. Was some sort of religious institution. <laughs> this is the flavor oh, I like, though. I, I like this type of dialogue. Thought. But everything in here seems to be related to the worship of some guy from back in the day. Some guy. <laughs> People used to come here to learn about him, to dress like him, move like him, to be him. If that's not worship, I don't know what is. <laughs> Tell me more. Oh, well, that's, Something yeah. like that, yeah. There were some working tapes here when we first got here, so we know what he's saying. Oh, about. okay. Sadly. They stopped working a few years back. Huh. So I sold them to a junk merchant who was passing through. Otherwise, oh, I'd man, you should have saved them in case we could All fix the it. outfits you see my guys wearing around were originally found in here, too, along with more hair gel than you can shake a stick <laughs> in. Not a whole lot to tell. There were only a few books left in here when we found it, and those were rotted away. Oh. There were some posters left that were pretty well preserved, which is how we know all this stuff was based on the same <laughs> guy. The thing of it is, we don't even know what his they name was. They don't even was. know what All his name was. It's probably for uh, copyright <laughs> reasons, maybe. <laughs> well, that and the giant sign outside. This place could have been the king's house of dog chow, and I still would have taken the name. Really? But I like to think I keep the memory alive. As Rex, you want some chow? <laughs> the guy that built this place was considered the coolest of the cool. He built this he place. Other people I don't think he actually like built him. this place. People would come all around to learn how to sing, dance, dress, and even speak the way he did. Wow. Sure thing. What'd you have in mind? Um, I guess that's it. I don't need. Uh, oh yeah, let's Whoa join. There. Not just anyone can be a king. What? We're better than all these losers. We usually only accept people native to the area. Oh uh, well. Second. I have to approve. You don't, and I don't. You haven't shown me. I haven't shown you. I killed yet. the guy killing your kings. But if you're kings. fixing to join something fierce, stick around. And if you play your cards, and right, I fix your dog. What change. else can I do that's even better than fixing the dog? I don't We've even know. We've to pass our philosophy on to the people of Freeside, but not everyone is ready to be. No, a I don't think so. The kids love us, but the old timers tend to shy away and keep to themselves. And they probably couldn't pull off the look anyway. Nah. As for the others. Some people just plain don't respect others, and that's a no-no. 
If there's one thing I won't tolerate, it's lack of respect. Okay. All right, cool, cool, cool. About that favor. No, we don't need a favor All right. yet. I'll see you later. What's All up? All right. I don't know. Now I don't know where we are. All right, oh, there it is. All right, let's get out of here. Is he talking to Veronica? All right. Pretty good. All right, let's go over here to the uh, the Wrangler and see what's up. We had some stuff to talk to them about, I think. All right. Let's wrangle some stuff. Evening. Maybe not. Oh, yeah, this is the guy, Henry. Shove off. You're making my luck turn bad. Well, yeah. What are we talking about? Fuck at? no. No matter what that old bitch McLafferty says, my dad said I could be in charge of the new baby. Oh, Vegas man, a spoiled kid. Besides, nepotism, guys. This is called nepotism. If I quit the Crimson Caravan, how am I supposed to get the money to gamble? <laughs> right. Well, let's just talk to the Emeritus about you, unless you feel like quitting. <laughs> Oh man, eight As out of fifty. Talk to you. Eight out of fifty. You're nobody. I'm Henry fucking James. Henry freaking who? <laughs> we can't do any of these quests, man. I want my man. debt with the Omertas paid off, and I want one of those severance package things. All right. Big one. Well, <laughs> you do that, and tell the old bitch to pay up quick. I here. couldn't argue with that. <laughs> All right. Well, you know what? I think he deserves it just to shut him up. And you know what? His dad will be, you know, better off. All right. Howdy. Oh, there she is. We we got her the job here. Goodbye. Uh, we don't need to partake. Uh, not with Veronica watching. That's for sure. All right, Jimmy. Hey, chum. Welcome back. What's up, Jimmy? Sure. Take a look. Does this guy have anything? No, we don't need anything. Later. Later, Gator. All right. <laughs> Hey. Yeah. All right. GG. All right. Let's go to uh, back to the caravan here. We're just going to. There's no way I'm walking everywhere, guys. Not as immersive, but, you know, that's why they give you the pit boy. You blip there and you don't even know, you know, the, the pit boy just takes you there instantly and uh, you don't got to ask any questions. Bro. 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 Get out of my freaking way. Evening. Yeah, it is evening. All right, where is this? Is she still in her office or is she going to bed? I don't think she's even still here. Yep, we just missed her. All right, well, she ain't going to be too happy about the way that worked out. Where the frick is your boss? She sleeps in one of these barracks somewhere. I gotta find out. Right to the right. All right. I guess it's here. We just gotta get in. All right. Hey. Hey. You seen Alice? Oh, in the standing in the corner. All right. Welcome back. Well, we fired him. Yes, but at significant cost. Yeah. I understand you not only agree well, that the company pay off his gambling debts, but he also gets severance. We're not too I'm good at the talking type of negotiation. Well, done, done. If we could have punched him, we would have, you know, done it. But they don't have that option there. <laughs> don't want to get blood all over the uh, Wrangler, you know. <laughs> we're buddies with them. Oh, we can't steal that. All right, guys, that, oh, that's not the way. I thought that was another door. Rex, don't get put me in the bathroom. Anyway, guys, this guy is always in my way. That's going to be it for this episode of Punching and Sploding Our Way Through the New Vegas Commonwealth. Thanks for watching, everyone, and we'll see you next time.